What's up everybody? Welcome back to Build and Battle MTG. My name is Austin if you're new and today we're looking at um, some new spoiler cards from Phyrexia All Will Be One, the new set coming out on February 10th. So let's not waste any time on the intro and get right into it. One quick theme before we get started actually, uh, the link to the MTG channel's uh, discord is in the description down below if you're interested in that. So check that out if you're interested. All right, let's get started with the first card here. So if you are a fan of the channel, you know that I particularly enjoy playing Infect, especially in Commander. I built a Fane the Finbearer Commander deck. I enjoy playing this a lot. So it's cool to see the new Toxic mechanic coming out of Phyrexia All Will Be One, showing some new Poison Counter support. So the first card I want to take a look at is Nimrazor Paladin. It's a five drop for four and a black, Phyrexian Knight, four, four, and it has Toxic 2. So um, the new ability Toxic is not like Infect. It says players dealt combat damage by this creature also get two poison counters because it has Toxic 2. So if it was Toxic 1, you'd get one poison counter and you get the gist on that. Um, it's objectively much worse than Infect because Infect can hurt creatures for minus one, minus one counter damage. But more importantly, uh, Infect poison counter damage scales with the creature's power and this does not. Um, nevertheless, this is a, still a extremely powerful ability, uh, any poison counter support is definitely welcome, um, because we haven't seen it printed in a long, in a long time. So, this card says, when Nimrazor Paladin enters the battlefield, return target creature card with mana value 3 or less from the graveyard to your hand. So this is great in a poison counter build, uh, because a lot of the creatures that hit for poison counter damage or a lot of the cards that hit for poison counter damage are creatures. So you can return this from the graveyard to your hand and have a nice uh, attacker ready to deal some poison damage on the field. I like this card a lot. And yeah. All right, the next card on our list that I'm looking at is Goliath Hatchery. So it's a six drop for four and two green enchantment. And it says when Goliath Hatchery enters the battlefield, create two, three, three green Phyrexian beast, beast creature tokens with toxic one. So again, these can hit for poison damage which i am a huge fan of so i think this card's very cool and it also has the new corrupted ability which says at the beginning of your upkeep if an opponent has three or more poison counters choose a creature you control then draw cards equal to its toxic value so obviously this is going to give you two creatures with toxic one um which you can then draw cards with if you meet the corrupted uh you know restriction on that but this also works since it is an enchantment on all your other creatures. So imagine having a creature like Paladin of Predation on your field with Toxic 6. It's just rewarding you for playing creatures, which you have to do if you want to win uh, through poison counters, especially in Commander. So um, I think this card's really neat. It rewards you for playing creatures, which you need in a deck. And I like this card a lot. So tell me what you guys think about it. All right, the next uh, new Toxic card that... Is coming out of Phyrexia All Will Be One that we're looking at is Mere Convert. So this card reminds me a lot of a of a older card that has Infect, which I will show you in a sec. But let's look at this one for a sec. So it's a two drop two one artifact creature Phyrexian Mirror. It has Toxic One, so if you hit a player with this, it also gives them one poison counter, and you can tap it, pay two life, and add one mana of any color. So uh, you know, in, on this channel, most of the cards we are looking at are specifically looked at for the use in Commander, so that paying two life threshold to add the mana, not that big of a deal, especially in Commander, since we start out with, um, you know, 40 life. The card this reminds me of that is very powerful in the Infect builds and almost run in every Commander Infect build ever is Plague Mirror. So this is a two drop, uh, one, one Infect Mirror, just like, you know, same mana cost as the last one, same creature type. It has Infect, and you can tap it to add one to your mana pool. So, I mean, objectively, you could decide which one is better. This one adds generic mana. Oh, sorry, I gotta zoom out there. This one adds generic mana. This one you have to pay life, but you could add one mana of any color. This one adds Toxic, which is worse than Infect. You know, they're both really good cards. Both definitely gonna see play in, I, I think, pretty much all of the uh, casual to mid-range um, level infect builds in commander so i like this card a lot it's a great addition to the poison counter strategy in commander in my opinion 
All right, the next toxic card up on our list, I think is going to be underrated um, unless you really understand the full potential of this card. So it's Skrelv Defector Might. It is a one drop in white, which is super important and I'll compare it to another card later, but let's take a look at this one first. One drop in white, one one, legendary artifact creature Phyrexian Might. Okay, one drop toxic one. So on your first turn, you can already get this toxic creature out. It cannot block, that's okay, we want to be attacking with our toxic creatures anyways for the most part to get in for that poison damage. And then you can pay a Phyrexian mana, so it can either be paid with white or two life, so very flexible with the life payment option. You can tap it, choose a color, and it says, another choose a color, another target creature you control gains toxic one he and hexproof from that color until end of turn. It can't be blocked by creatures of that color this turn. This is a extremely powerful ability. So I get that you can't attack with this if you activate this ability, but this card is super flexible, being able to play it early game in Commander, getting in for that uh, toxic poison counter damage. Great for early game. Do not underestimate this early game poison counters being on your opponents. And then um, the ability down below, just giving your any creature hexproof um, at instant speed is extremely powerful. You don't even have to pay mana for this. You can pay life. But also giving it toxic one and it can't be blocked by the chosen color that you choose is also extremely powerful. So uh, do not underestimate this card. This card is going to see a ton of play in Commander Infect decks, um, at least in my opinion. And this card, this card uh, definitely reminds me of another one drop uh, poison counter damage dealing card that we have in the format. Um, namely Glistener Elf. All right, so this card's, you know, it's sees play in Infect Commander decks. It's a very simple card, but you can get it down early and get in for that early poison counter damage, which is what Infect decks need. This is why I think that the Defector Might is going to see a ton of play in these types of decks. I love this card a lot. Tell me if you guys think it's as powerful as I'm making it up to be. I definitely think it's probably even more powerful than Glistener Elf. I know Toxic is worse than Infect, but this one's really good. All right, in the last new exciting Toxic card that we are covering in this video, there's many more, so comment down below if you want to see uh, my other favorites. But this one is called Containment Gra Contaminant Grafter. It's a 5-drop for Forna Green, 5-5 five, five Phyrexian Druid, Trample, and Toxic 1. Uh, Trample's great for this creature to get in for that Toxic 1 hit. Whenever one or more creatures you control deal combat damage to one or more players proliferate. So this only happens once. And then it says it has the ability corrupted. At the beginning of your end step, if an opponent has three or more poison counters, draw a card. Then you may put a land card from your hand onto the battlefield. So the last ability, the corrupted ability, you really want to hit that threshold of at least one of your opponents having three or more poison counters. By the time you play this on turn five, you probably already have that in the commander game. Great. Um, this card's very versatile. Having a uh, card draw on it with that restriction of corrupted, which you probably have, so we're just going to say you have it. You have card draw, uh, land ramp, toxic uh, trampoline creature that's relatively big. Pretty big, actually, yeah. And uh, also the ability to proliferate, which is great in this style of deck, getting more poison counters on your opponents. I, I think this card's really good. It covers, you know, some major points that you need in Commander on a card. Uh, great card design. I love this card a lot. We'll definitely be running it in my Infect Commander decks. All right, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, leave a comment down below if you want me to cover more cards like this from the new Phyrexia All Will Be One set. I will be glad to do so. I hope you guys have a good day and please subscribe.